So you're thinking about moving or relocating here to the Beaver Creek area, and you're curious what's around here. Well, in this video, what we're gonna do is go over some of the things that you'll need to know before coming here. So stay tuned. What's up everybody? This is Tim Whittemore with the Whittemore Group right here in Dayton, Ohio and currently in Beaver Creek. If this is your first time to our channel, we do tons and tons of videos about everything you need to know about our area. As a military veteran of about 14 years and now a military spouse, I've done and moved so many different places. And every time I moved somewhere, there was always such a lack of information of where to move to and what to go check out and where things were. So that's why we created this channel for you. So uh, go ahead and click that subscribe button, ring that little bell so that you're notified every single time we got a new video coming out. I mean, honestly, we get tons of phone calls and emails and texts from people every single day uh, that are moving to this area and need some help and we absolutely love it. So if you are coming to this area and you need some help, go ahead, give us a call, text, email, shoot us a little paper airplane, <laughs> whatever you need to do, we got your back when moving here to Beaver Creek or the surrounding areas. All right, guys, so uh, what we're gonna talk about today is here is in Beaver Creek. Uh, today, I'm actually in the Green, which is one of the shopping centers uh, that they do have here. Lots of food, upscale restaurants, uh, shops, uh, whatever you wanna imagine here. We we got it here, over here at the Green. Now, there are a couple of other different places that you can come and check out, uh, but we'll get into that here in a little bit. Uh, one thing I do wanna tell you is Beaver Creek. So, where is that located? Uh, actually, it's located just south of Wright-Patterson Air Force Base, just south of Fairfield. Uh, it's actually pretty good and affluent area that uh, you'll definitely wanna check out. In this area, there's probably 54 different neighborhoods. Now I'd go through and name them all, but I figure that's probably another video that we can put together later. <laughs> um, but there's 54 different neighborhoods. So you're probably wondering, hey, what are the most expensive ones? What are the least expensive? Well, the most expensive one that we do have is in the southeastern corner. Uh, that's kind of where the country club and everything is at. So uh, that's the area to go check out uh, for the most expensive. If you're looking for the most affordable ones, our most affordable ones are really in the central area, which is just north of Route 35 and on the eastern side. They also call it Alpha, depending on which site you go to check out. <laughs> so let's talk about housing costs too. Some of the housing costs that you can anticipate in our area here in Beaver Creek is uh, gonna be an average around 250,000. Now, you'll notice that a lot of places here, yeah, they're a little bit older. It's not exactly brand new construction, but uh, still pretty good medium to large size houses that you do have here. Uh, if you're looking for the price range, it could be all the way up to around 842,000 and as low as 66. Now, again, that 66 has probably got a hole in the roof or something. <laughs> If you are looking to rent out here, rent prices are right around uh, $1,202 per month if you are looking to rent a single family. Now, that's gonna change as, as uh, you go and look at townhomes or condos or something of that nature. So just kind of keep that in mind. Uh, some other great things around here are the parks. Now, there are like 25 different green spaces and parks all throughout Beaver Creek. Uh, really, really nice communities, really put together. People take a lot of pride in that. Uh, so definitely uh, a great place to go. Take the kids, you know, go to the park, take the dog out, whatever. <laughs> All right, other things too here that you want to check out is the school systems. The K through 12 systems rated A plus uh, on niche.com if you do check that out. Uh, they also have the three colleges nearby and a university here in the nearby cities uh, that you can definitely go take a look at. Now, we are in the shopping center, so let's talk about that. There are lots of different shopping, restaurants, everything. When people are living out towards this side of the city, of the suburbs, people generally drive out to Beaver Creek to uh, go ahead and get that shopping and all the restaurants and things like that. 
if you could see behind me there's actually plenty of them going on <laughs> so you can definitely do that we also have the fairfield commons if you check in our other videos uh, they have those out there too uh, with with a outdoor mall uh, in mostly actually an indoor mall uh, there's outdoor shops is what i meant to say uh, but there are uh, indoor malls there's restaurants shopping so you know when it gets cold out here and you're trying to get off of that seasonal depression uh, that's probably a good place to go check out and if you are down here in the green and you've probably heard this in one of my other videos here too is to go check out the mongolia grill i might come and get it i already ate but i think i'm gonna go get some after i make this video <laughs> Uh, some other things about, of course, Ohio and this general area is you do get the four seasons here. So if you're looking to move somewhere else besides uh, Ohio that's up in this area or somewhere completely different, uh, that's the one thing we love. It's fall at the time of this video and it is gorgeous outside. So when we do get this weather, we get awesome festivals and things of that nature. There's an amphitheater even here in Beaver Creek. Uh, that there are shows and things going on all the time as long as it's not 2020 and the pandemic hits and everybody's wearing masks so uh, <laughs> even though it has been happening that way uh, the people here are still making the best of it there's still a lot of things that are going on uh, despite the fact and you know people are still in really good spirits here which is one of the reasons I really love this place is just because of all the friendly people uh, I've actually been waved out a couple of times by just walking around here <laughs> and uh, it's uh, it's really nice and people here are very very friendly uh, always willing to help out and it's it's certainly just a, a great place to live so definitely uh, stick around because we do have some places that we'll be showing you and kind of panning around so that you can get an idea of what it's really like to live here in Beaver Creek. One of the great things that they do have here in Beaver Creek, as I mentioned before, is all the great parks that they do have. Uh, we even got some for some fishing for the kids. Uh, there's a skate park in this particular one. Uh, there's just a whole ton of stuff to do outside and it's absolutely gorgeous. So that's all we have for you for today about Beaver Creek and the things that you'll need to know. Uh, if you have any questions about anything that we talked about today, make sure to go ahead and leave them in the comments below. Uh, if you are moving out here and you need some help, feel free to reach out to myself or my team. Uh, you can call, text, email, or whatever you got to do. Uh, we got your back when moving here. And we'll uh, see you here over in Beaver Creek. See ya. See ya.